Today officially marks the end of an 11 year employment agreement with my former employer. Despite the difficulty of the last 17 months, I am so grateful for the nine and a half years where I was able to bring a touch of beauty and a dash of magic to brides on their wedding day. To the 40,000 plus brides and bridesmaids that let me partake in your special day, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. The memories many of you have so graciously and excitedly shared with me over the years are my lifeblood and I will treasure you forever. Unfortunately, I know that I will be disappointing many people with this next update and for that, I am so sorry. A few days ago, I received the district court's opinion revising the preliminary injunction previously issued on March 4th of 2021. To summarize, my former employer argued that my employment agreement prohibits me or others from identifying myself to the trade or consuming public as the designer of any goods in competition with the products of my former employer for a period of five years from the end of my contract. The district court found that this prohibition applies even if I were to identify myself as the designer of competing products under a new name. And still, since November of 2019, I have not received any commission for the work I have performed under contract with my former employer. With respect to Instagram and Pinterest, the district court has awarded full control for now to my former employer. My biggest motivation in fighting for these accounts comes from the impact that my lawsuit will have on the future of case law for social media. These property-based claims, which turn on the novel question of ownership of social media accounts is necessary and appropriate and so timely, and I will be appealing both of these decisions. Despite all of this, I am so grateful that so many of you have found me over here and are just continuing to tell your friends where I've gone and are still choosing to share your beautiful moments with me. Finding your dream dress is a big freaking deal. It is inspiring, intuitive, loving, celebratory, and it is something that I will always support. And despite the emotion that overcomes me at times, I do not see myself as a victim. In fact, I see the lengths that my former employer is willing to go to keep my talent out of an industry as a great complement of my skill set. I don't know a single artist who hasn't experienced a period of doubt in their career or in their capabilities, and I am just appreciative that this entire experience has given me so much more confidence and a much greater mission. On that sentiment, I believe in a good pivot and reimagining your own destiny, and I want to thank you for inspiring me to find a way through this storm. I've known for a while that Staying optimistic and hopeful was never enough to get me to that next chapter of my life. So while the beginning of this update was rather disenchanting, we are now shifting to something I consider sunny side up. I also think after the last two years we've all had, we could use some gosh darn good news. And rather than waiting for that good news to find us, it's simply time to go create our own. I'm thrilled to share that I will be pursuing something entirely new in a product category that is non-competitive with my former employer. And without saying too much, we're spilling the beans. It is something that will allow me to extend my creative reach and serve up sparkle to any girl you might know. In the coming weeks, I will be sharing more of my creative journey and artistic reinvention, which also includes the debut of a newly formed philanthropic initiative that will provide resources to safeguard the interests of young women and creatives during the formative years of their career. So pretty please mark your calendars because I will be announcing my new name one week from today, Monday, August 8th, right here on this Instagram. And next month, I will be sharing news about my new position with a new non-competitive brand. I've always been somebody that's big on sneak peeks and Easter eggs and early dibs. So there is a link in bio you can grab if you are big on that too. 
I've come to realize how important it is to stay connected to a community in a way that is personal and not so dependent on social media. So this mailing list will be the keystone to our future communications. And finally, to anyone out there that feels mischaracterized or continually beaten down by life, I want you to know that there is so much worth fighting for in this world, especially fighting for who you are and staying true to yourself. Like Beyonce says, I am one of one and you won't break my soul. I was gonna say see you soon, but see you now and happy August.